so we basically just had our own little scene that everybody came to go check out and see what the buzz was going on and the reason why the buzz was was sweet around here was this all the clubs that i was going to at the time was within i would say maybe a six block radius i mean you had the court tavern the court tavern was probably the most this other than the bowler drum which came later as i was um in the scene later on in my time in the scene you had the court tavern which was the most remote but that didn't even count as being remote because it was just right there near the train station you had to walk up a little bit to see roxy melody Roxy was on one side of the street, Melody was on the other. You go check out a band at the Roxy, go across the street, check out another band at the Melody. But the melody, you go up, and it was more or less the Sistine Chapel. I think it was their nickname at one point because every every quarter or so they will repaint the walls into being this um into these murals that were just like, why would we want to paint this over paint over this in about three or four months? Why? And I mean, upstairs, downstairs, people people used to do some work in the melody, and I got a little bit I got a little bit of that on um on video because channel x actually covered that we did a um somebody was putting out a book i don't think it ever came out called if these walls would talk if these walls could talk and i showed the artwork that was at the melody and at the and at the roxy and it was just some of the greatest work i had seen in a club at that time